Scott, Hi. you're out here sleeping rough in London. Tell me about it. Um, it's not exactly easy. Been out here about six weeks. Just lost everything in a matter of days. Nowhere to live. No money. Everything. My clothes. I'm literally out here with what I've got. On, clothes I've got on my back. Um, been either sleeping here. Trying to find a park, anywhere that's warm really. Not exactly in many places to go. Places that aren't exactly clean. Got covered in bites all over my arms, my legs, my feet. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's not it's not the best. So how are you surviving? Um just of what people are helping me with. Like I'm I'm not trying to say I don't want to really take money off people, so it's more people are leaving me food and something to drink. Yeah. Things like that, because I don't. I'm not. I'm not out here to make money. It's not what I need. I don't need money. I need a way to live. Been looking for a job. But I've been trying to find somewhere that help me out with some clothes, enough for a pair of trousers and a shirt to try and find a job. So there's services all around here for rough sleeping. Nobody's helping you. No. Well, why is that? Because <clears throat> I'm not from the area. I moved down from the northeast into Hampshire, and then I moved there with my partner. That didn't go according to plan. I was out on my my backside, nowhere to live. So I came here thinking that there'd be places here that'd be easier to find help. And it's just not nothing at all, unless you've got a local connection. If you've been, you have to have been here six out of the last 12 months and things like that. And they just don't refer you to nothing unless you are from London. So what's your future like? I'm not exactly sure at the minute. <laughs> if I can find a job, then I'd, I'd stay in London or if I can find a job just to get myself back to the northeast, at least where I know people, then that's the easiest way to do it. If you had three wishes, what would they be? A roof, my family, and a decent meal. Well, thank you very much for talking to me. No problem. Thank you.